what is going on guys like I promised a video or two ago I was supposed to go tr truck camping and I actually did but it didn't really work out so here's how it went what is going on guys crafty mind is back and we're going truck camping Woo! I wanted to make uh, truck camping videos for the longest time, I just never pulled the trigger, but now we're here. We're gonna be in Colorado for the next 3 or 4 days, so if you like truck camping videos, make sure you subscribe, make sure you like the video, so we get it in front of more people. You've arrived. Destination is on your left. We made it to Denver. Denver, Colorado, finally. Um, it's pretty chilly. Uh, I'm about to make some food because I'm freaking hungry, but I'm just gonna make some wieners. I don't feel like making anything else. I'm just gonna eat and go to sleep because that drive killed me. Because I live in Illinois, so it's, uh, it's a far drive. Let's make some food. Never cooked like this, but we'll see how it works. Oh my gosh, I don't feel like making anything else. I feel so awkward doing this, but whatever, I gotta get used to it. Bon appetit! <laughs> I promise tomorrow we're gonna actually cook. This is not cooking, but it's decent. And it's like brand new, ready for tomorrow. Let's go check out what they have at Cabela's. I'm not, I don't need anything, but might as well. Let's go. Ooh, nice. That's cool. Nice fishing tent. This one is even better. Cool. I didn't really walk around the store too much. There was this grandpa following me everywhere, asking if I need help every five seconds. I don't know if he was thinking that I was stealing something or what, because I was there alone. But now I feel uneasy over here. So I'm gonna go uh, park at Cracker Barrel. Yeah, let's go there, because I know they don't care if you overnight park there, park overnight. So let's go there, it's like five minutes away. It was a very weird experience at Cabela's. The, the, the guy was following me, asked me three times if I needed help. It was very weird. But uh, I came to Cracker Barrel. We'll be fine here because there's a dedicated RV parking. So we'll be fine. No one's gonna be weird about us. We are alone here. There's someone with a trailer over there. So, it'll be our neighbor for the night. 
and I'll call it a night over here. So I'm ready for bed. It ain't much, but it'll do. Uh, let me get my GoPro. This, because the lens on this camera isn't wide enough. This is more than enough. If this cooler bothers me, I'm gonna move it, move it up here because there's enough room, I think. But this is gonna have to do for now. We'll see. If anything happens, if I get a knock on the window, I'll report back. Good night. Oh my god, I think someone's knocking on the window. Just kidding, you guys. Good night. So after that last clip, um, I went to sleep. I couldn't really sleep. I maybe slept for an hour. I was really uncomfortable. Um, the fridge was in the way. I tried putting it up on the armrest. It didn't really work out. And there, there was actually people driving around, so I couldn't fall asleep. Um, I got annoyed. And at like 5 a.m. in the morning, I went home. So yeah, I drove to Colorado and back. And I spent one night there. I was still gonna go hiking, but then I'm like, I'm still gonna have to spend another night here. So I just went home. Right now, I'm building out my truck. Uh, it's gonna be a nice build. I actually pulled some cables through already. Um, I did weather sealing. Right now, I was um, doing a pass-through window. So in two or three months, make sure you're on the lookout for truck camping videos, because that's all I'm gonna be doing. That's been my dream for the past four or five years. Uh, I was actually gonna buy a transit van, but I bought a truck and I'm happy with it. So make sure you subscribe, make sure you smash that like button, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.